Welcome to Insurrection Field in Brain, Washington, BS, home of the Cadavers. The Cadavers? What creative genius came up with that name? Well, when a team asks the biggest MFL star announcer what he thinks the team should be named, he gives his opinion. Well, in my opinion, the only name more stupid would be the Commanders. <laughs> The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for MFL action. The Diami Krakens battle. The Brain Washington Cadavers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitro here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down greased street poles and eating all-you-can-eat horseship buffets from the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. Second down in a very lot. Defense holds him to a four yard pickup there. Third down and, well, good luck. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. Receiver runs away from the pass marker. That's a good clue that something's not right. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Well, that was a good throw. Yeah, if he was aiming for the ground. Third down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It's... Oh, hello! with the punishing hit. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's 
First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Republican congressman hits the... Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot. Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two. Hot, 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 hot. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Man, he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Hot. Hot. Hey, man, I was here on the now. You know what happened? <laughs> Third down and long. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. That would have been a disappointing run. It's even a worse throw. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. right through. Yeah, like a double stop. But, oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. Yeah. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast hammer sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, nah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. Hot. Hot one. Hot. It's a glitter. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Hey, okay, now back him. Come on, get on the gun. Get on the gun. Get on And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Ouch. Anyone in the mood for steak tartare? Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I got to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Second down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, I'm 
Swiss on rye with the uh, no mustard. <laughs> I like this, they're going for two. You can't keep it. Bam! Gutsy run for the conversion. See that boot, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Hunt, hunt one, hunt two, hunt, hunt three. to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. He is fighting for every yard. Oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. Oh, look at this guy break tack. He's rumbling and stumbling. He, oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. He's at the 40. A touchdown saving tackle. First and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. And a pickup of about three on that play. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. Third down and six. point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. This guy's a brick shit house. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. The quarterback passes the ball, and they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback's going to be hurting, or dead, or worse. Second down and long. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. Second and three. Wrestling? Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. Point with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, he's probably haven't intercepted though. No, that's a real buzzkill. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. Pow! When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. <laughs> the offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And the quarterback calls a shot. Oh, he just made mincemeat out of that guy. Hey, what is mincemeat anyway? Is it like bologna? Uh, yeah, I'm going to get a sandwich. is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. The 
defense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! Second down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck raccoon rabi blood is my thought always a player's favorite the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit yeah but on the bright side win they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore uh, the funeral expenses that is Third down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They just be caught. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Man, this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. The defense. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all Grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. <laughs> <laughs> the offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Second down and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and ten. Love the sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when it. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. And that'll bring up third. De Defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> First and ten. And this, oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. 
Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy! And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite thing because he's the one who just got wiped out. With me? Well, you mistake a man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. Yep. There's a funny red head on the field. No, that's their red penalty marker, Briggs. Looks like this one's coming back. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a conference at home. Nobody can touch you with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, huh? And it's first and ten. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And it's first and ten. The quarterback avoids the rush. One oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. A man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. Welcome back to the start of the second half. It's a close game and should be a battle to the end. The teams line up for the kickoff. And my second half buzz is just kicking it right on time. <laughs> Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. Interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. I knew when the coach said the offense was gonna be explosive this week, he meant it literally. You can't pretend it. I won't even get out of here. 
Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And Briggs, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that. Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Hot, hot one, eight. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He said he might catch him. Move, you fat little mutant. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the NFL. <laughs> They're back up here on first, and the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. He could be. He might be. He is gone. He is not coming. Oh, man. Talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay. He just ran into a buzzsaw. Whoa, Mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. First and ten. And the quarterback. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. That's true. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs>
The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. They're moving the ball now with authority. And that'll bring up second and one. or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. Great Washington wins by forfeit. The Cadavers will take the win any way they can get it. And killing is just as good as scoring touchdowns. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I have wounds taste just like chicken. 
Or was it scrambles tomato soup? Wounds. Mm-hmm. Good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Oh, seriously, man, you think you'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.